All right, so here we go. Now, we did pick monkey. Now we're going to move to pick slurp. So, what you're going to do is you're going to go to Google or Internet Explorer or Firefox. You're going to type in Pixlr, P I X L R. You want to go to Pixlr Express, but if you just type in Pixlr, click enter, you're going to go to Pixlr.com. I wouldn't go to this one because that's the more advanced one. I would go to this one first, pixlr.com photo editor online. Click there. And then you're going to scroll down. And you're going to click on Pixlr Express and click on launch web app. If it asks for Java, click yes. You want to enable Java, enable Flash. Click on browse. Or you can take a picture of yourself if you have a netbook. But we'll do what we did before with with uh, PicMonkey. Just find the picture. There's the one that we made, the Lobos ride with PicMonkey. I'm going to pick the same picture, open it, it opens up. And this one has all the buttons at the bottom. So if I wanted to add a border to it, I could add a border to it. And there's different borders. These are not the only borders. So let's say I wanted to add uh, something in nature. If I click on nature, other nature borders pop up. And I can use these arrows to find something that I might want to use. So let's say I wanted to use, I don't know. Let's say I wanted to, this one looks kind of cool here, this Safina. If I click on it, it adds like a zebra look to it. <laughs> Make sure you click apply. If you don't click apply, it won't it won't apply it obviously. So click apply. And then it stays. If you wanted to add type, you can add type stickers. Let's say I wanted to put uh Dia de los Muertos like a Day of the Dead on here. I could do that. And you see how large it comes out, right? Well, not a big not a big deal. You can make it smaller. Maybe I want to. Maybe I want to put it on the side of the car, like right there. See how? See, how I can put it right there, and then I can put apply. And then let's say I want to add something else. Let's say I want to do effects, right? So let's say I want like, um, I don't know, let's say this lightning here or something. It looks like lightning. And I want this to happen. I don't know where I want this to happen. Let's say I want this to happen, I don't know, like in the back of the car somewhere. Like right here somewhere. Like it's getting struck by lightning. I can add that. You can add anything you want pretty much. Uh, let's say I wanted to add um, effect. So you have, see, let's say I did this. Let's say I wanted to put this on there. You see how it, ch it totally changes it, right? So if you click here, you can change the amount, you see? So let's say you wanted it just like that. By the way, if you didn't want something, just click cancel and it will take it off. And you have type, you can add type in. Um, did we do the overlays? Yeah, so this is, so let's say I wanted to add something like this. Let's say a, a like a full or smoke. Let's say smoke. And I wanted let's say smoke, uh, let's say like this smoke. Like angry smoke. I can add angry smoke. If I don't want it so strong, I can you see how I can decrease it? Click apply. Let's say I wanted a flame. Like boom. Let's say uh, let's say maybe I want a flame. I don't know. Like let's say this kind of flame. It looks 
They see it, you see the you, I don't know if you can see it very well, but you can you can can you see the flames right right here? It's kind of hard to see, but there's flames. You can tell right there there's flames. It's in the middle of the picture right here. You can kind of see it. You can kind of see the flames there. See, there you go. There's an, that's another example of it. I know many of you are going to be in the stickers looking, though, because they do have some pretty cool stuff in, in, this, in these stickers. So uh, let's say I wanted to add like a, I don't know, it looks like a, like an, like a, like an antique stopwatch. I could add that. You can put it anywhere you want. You can move them around. Um, it doesn't matter what you. It doesn't matter what you add. Let's say like this plane right here. I wanted to add this plane, so I just click on it, and boom, it puts it in there for me. Why do I want to put a plane in this picture? I have no idea, but I'm just showing you that's what that's what you can do. Oh, look, it's the air show. The the plane's flying over the car. All right, so that is Pixlr. By the way, this one, if you want to save it, click on save. It's going to ask you for the quality. You can change the name of it here. Let's say I want to, I want to say uh, Pixlr. Click on save. And we'll save it to your pictures, save. And then it'll be there in your pictures. And then you can use it as your background. All right, that is Pixlr. Hope everything's going well. Don't miss me. Bye-bye. Oh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm.